Knee flexion also, end ranges of knee flexion uh, can be problematic um, if you do have a bit of a meniscus tear in there. So you're gonna figure out where they're symptomatic and then sometimes you can gap a little bit. So I'll put my arm in here, get a little bit of a gap and then do my flexion mobilizations. Or don't be afraid to go into this direction if it's painful. Just be slow, maybe go to, that, to the point where the uh, patient starts feeling their symptoms and maybe I'm just gonna work there a little bit and just make sure that it's not getting any worse, that you're not irritating it. Maybe add a little bit of internal rotation or external rotation. And then as, they, as we build a little bit of tolerance to that, you can actually increase and go a little bit further, add tibial abduction and tibial adduction with your mobilizations.